got to film. Um, but basically, it's the first day and we're heading off to Berlin to visit a bunch of big startups, VCs, and it should be amazing. So, we're off. Yes. <laughs> So our first stop on the tour was actually at a co-working space called Beta House and Beta House houses a bunch of different companies uh, from startups to medium sized teams and what we were there for was a morning of pitches so it was breakfast with Beta House, we had three startups pitched to us, one was a image uh, cropping service, another one was a VR studio solutions um, and the lastly one the most interesting was called Robin Hood and they're aiming to provide uh, affordable housing cheaper than a flat share in Berlin. Next up on our startup tour was home to go and as they claimed, they are the largest search engine in the world for holiday homes. Now, during our presentation, we got to sit down and learn a little bit about the history of the company. We got to ask questions about their direction, some of their strategies, including recent acquisitions. And it was just a really great presentation and we got to sit down with the CEO, Patrick Andrea, and ask him what it's like managing such a rapidly growing company. Now next up on the tour we went to Point9 Capital, our first VC that we went to on the tour and we actually had a masterclass into everything VC from going into a deep dive to deal flow and we looked at this with Julia, an ex work student which was really nice, felt really welcomed and it was just a great way to get an introduction into VC. So overall it was a really good presentation. Day two of the startup tour, we're heading to Go Euro, which is essentially a journey planner so that you can buy tickets from the UK to France and in a few clicks you can get your plane, train and bus ticket all included in one. And we got a talk from Bertrand, who is the head of Southwestern Europe at Go Euro, and it was a really awesome talk. They had a lovely office. And actually since recording this and going to the Go Euro office, um, they've actually rebranded to Omeo. So it'll be interesting to see how the rebrand works for them. Next up is Delivery Hero, far larger than the startup now. Delivery Hero are a company listed on the German Stock Exchange with over 1,300 employees at their central office in Berlin. Delivery Hero is a parent company to many small food delivery providers in countries across the world. Their strategy is to acquire the number one or number two player in a chosen market and dominate within the food industry. One of my favorite presentations was from Project A Capital, another VC fund, and we got to speak to Enrico, an investment manager who talked more about the structure of a successful VC and his insights from his recent deep dive into esports and gaming. 
Now for our last stop on the tour, we stopped off at Factor 10, which is a company builder that works with large corporates that have revenue in excess of I think around about a billion. So they have the backing of these businesses to build joint ventures of problems they need to solve. And it was a really cool company. And not only that, but they made us really welcome. There was a bunch of ex Warwick guys there that were talking to us and letting us know what it's like. And it was a really relaxed atmosphere and definitely a company I think you guys, it's worth checking out. Shout out to Nicola, Kane and ZR for making us feel welcome and know what it's like to be a Warwick graduate at one of these companies. Larry, how's the trip been so far? Yeah, it's been pretty decent. What's been your favourite talk? Well, I think Project A was pretty impressive. Yeah. Project A was pretty good. Yeah, it was. Um, what was your highlight, Bailey? I think it's got to be learning so much about the VC system here. I, and also just I would never knew anything about Berlin, never been to Germany, but learned a lot. Is it something you're interested in pursuing? A career in VC? VC, yeah, potentially. Yeah. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, yeah, but so good so far. This is Larry. Hey guys. <laughs>